Today, I'll be discussing to you our passion for a greener environment and explore ways we can work together and create a sustainable future. My name is Samantha Ruiz, your certified Kagwinari. Imagine a world where everywhere you look, your field of vision is filled with beautiful scenery. A beautiful scenery that will make your eyes feel the sense of peace and calm. Despite having numerous dilemmas that affects our lives, these beautiful scenarios can still put up our problematic mind in a calm and peaceful state. Imagine a world where the land is green with full of trees. Full of trees that provide us clean water to drink, an air to breathe, a shade and food to humans, animals, and plants. Imagine a world where the cities are adorned with green areas, where children can walk barefooted in the grass while having the freedom to laugh and play in the midst of the community. Just imagine if those children are not allowed to play outside because of the danger that our misconduct can furnish. What will happen into their future, into their education, to the future of society and the upcoming generations? Would you like them to experience a world with full of sufferings? Exactly not. That is why we, as the community, should work together hand in hand to heal the planet and build a brighter future for all. Ano na lang ang masasabi natin sa ating mga anak about the environment they inherit? Will you tell them you did everything you could to protect it? Or will you tell them you stood by and watched it go? Plastic waste is everywhere, from the corner of the streets, at the bodies of water, and in the habitats of animals, and at the forest. These issues are not isolated events. They impact our health, our food security, water supply, and importantly, the very foundation of our civilization. So, have you had your realization about the bizarre effect that our actions can furnish? Are you now awake about the current situation of our planet? About our underlying actions that significantly affects the only world we live in? Do you think that these things are still reversible? Maybe, but not totally. We can begin by altering our life into a more sustainable living. A more sustainable living that will allow us to achieve those kinds of aspirations. The Philippines' high plastic pollution is due to its large population, widespread of use of plastic sachet while having inadequate amounts of trash collectors, lack of a plastic bag bin, and plastic waste imports. By making small changes, we can make an immense difference.
sa bawat sulog ng syudad at ang pagkakaroon ng disiplina ng bawat sangkataon. Witnessing these kinds of scenarios is what encouraged me to take action. These kinds of scenarios will have a significant impact towards our whole well-being, both economically and morality, because the environment we live in will reflect the way we interact with it. If our environment is elegantly neat, then it will reflect on us that we are responsible and clean. That is why cleanliness is significant for us humans. It does not only benefit our morality, it will also benefit our whole well-being. Because if the environment is neat and immaculate, it will not just benefit our eyesight, it will also make us feel the presence of calmness. a world where urban and rural areas filled with green spaces alongside the city loaded with a sufficient amount of proper trash containers and to impress on people's minds that cleanliness is the hope of the society. seem ambitious but it is achievable through collective actions everything is possible i believe that every individual every community and every voice has the power to make difference by sharing information by taking actions and advocating for a change we can make a ripple effect that transform our world